Welcome to the Easy 2000 Plus video demonstration on how to enter a treatment plan for a patient. All treatment plans are entered through the chart module and when you click on the chart module you will be able to see the teeth numbers and uh, the treatment, all kinds of different conditions. We will first begin by selecting our patient and I'll pick this patient here, Mr. Hammonds, and I'm going to start entering treatment for this patient that needs to be done. The first thing I'm going to do is before I do my examination is I'm going to pull out the missing teeth so that we don't accidentally diagnose them. Okay, click missing, highlight the tooth, click missing, highlight the tooth, click missing, highlight the tooth, and click missing. Now we will begin with the teeth that need to have treatment. I'm a doctor and I'm doing the examination and I say, well, you know, tooth number two, I'm going to click on my treatment module. And again, I like to look procedures up by directly by the codes because it's faster. If I type in the letter D and I'm going to do a composite filling for tooth number two, I'm going to say OK. It will give me my tooth number two. And I'm going to put my surface as an OL. And I will say, just put $50 in here. And I will say OK. And you can see that it's coloring the filling in for the patient. Let's take a look and put in an amalgam for tooth number three. I will say OK. Put my tooth number in put an MOL, I'll put $50 for that one as well, and you can see it colors it in. I'm going to go ahead and add a crown for tooth number four. We'll make this guy real messy. You can see it colors the crown in for the patient. Perhaps on a tooth we need to extract the tooth put in a surgical extraction and we will put in tooth number 19 click OK and you can see that it will X out the tooth if I wanted to put in some perio treatment for a patient my upper right quad $200 and I will say OK it lists all of the treatment that you plan on doing for the patient on the lower right hand side of your screen and it will color all of the teeth that are going to be treated. If I go to my treatment plan, this is where you will manage the treatment that's been diagnosed. You click on your treatment plan button and all of the treatment diagnosed will appear. If I wanted to print a copy of my treatment plan, I could go to print and it will show on the screen a very nice treatment plan for the patient that will indicate the tooth chart, show the patient what teeth are going to be uh, worked on, it will give a description of all of the treatment that will be done, and it will also give you a breakdown of your insurance benefits and then a little descriptor at the bottom of the page that this is just an insurance estimate. Now once you have printed this out for the patient you can save the treatment plan and it puts it into the patient's permanent database or before you save it you can actually have a patient sign it if you have a kiosk at your office or a little signature pad. But this is what a treatment plan module looks like you can also prioritize your treatment plan. Uh, what is the most important? And let's just say that our perio scaling and root plane is the most important. We can prioritize it to a number one. And let's say that our fillings are going to be prioritized at number two. Maybe the patient wants to hold off on tooth number 14 or tooth number four and 19 due to financial uh, constraints. And we'll prioritize those two for number three. That way when the patient comes back in for their treatment and we know that this treatment has not been done, 
you will be able to see what's next on the list and what's the most important. So maybe you don't want to start off with just doing tooth number 19. You might want to just uh, work on tooth number 2 and 3 and get those fillings done before they turn into root canals. Uh, this is an example of a treatment plan. Thank you very much.